Okay, this is Gamer Blave, and we're back with Tank, and this is part three of our attack on the mutant outpost of Jefferson. Okay, so um, I went ahead and loaded my game, and I played the mission up until this point, and I just cut the video, um, I cut the other gameplay video up until this point, so, you know, you don't have to watch all of, uh, you know, me play the, the same mission up until this point. Since I'm a tough guy, you know, I can't load the game, I can't load the game, um, and come back, um, you know, come to a point, you know, immediately before this, you know, because I died, like, right, <laughs> right before here, but since, uh, I'm editing the video together, um, in terms of, uh, in terms of the edited video experience, we can have, uh, we can have a, a similar effect. If that makes any sense. So what is the point of this stairwell here? Whoa. That's kind of... That's kind of neat. Well, 24 9mm bullets. What the heck? That is completely useless. That is useless. That is not even pretending to not be useless. Okay. So I remember the guy in here from last time. There we go. Let's go ahead and grab this stuff. drop off those. Then we can drop the rest of my stuff in uh, in the inventory of my vehicle out here. But, um... Yeah, it was kind of a bummer. Kind of a bummer dying there, because uh, you know, it was a good bit, good bit of the way into that mission this mission. But uh, hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to uh, get it done this time. Got a bunch of stuff here. Bunch of stuff. So, let me have a look at the map again. So I've got down here, and I, I think I'm going to pop my um, my voodoo pretty soon. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Whoa, that sounded loud. Um, going to pop my voodoo pretty soon just to get a little bit more damage res resistance. Because, now, I mean... You, you might think that once you get up over 100, it doesn't make a difference. But I'm pretty sure the way that some of these weapons work is they actually... Oh, wow. Two, uh... Two 50 cals. Is they actually operate by effectively lowering uh, your damage resistance. They have, like, a... I guess what you'd think of as, like, armor piercing. Kind of. And I could be completely wrong about that. I mean, but uh, I think that's how some of it works. Um, so, 
you know, the higher you get up over a hundred, the, you know, the more resistant you are to those effects. I mean, that's why I'm still, t I mean, I'm over a hundred and I'm still taking damage. You know, it's not like I'm completely impervious to everything. Certainly doing pretty good, though. Doing pretty dang good, I think. Well, what do we got here? Environmental armor. Now, we're definitely going to check this out. I doubt that it's better than what I'm wearing here. but 120. My normal went up, so 40, 70, 40, 55, 10. So it looks like pretty much pretty much across the board everything's going up except for my armor class is dropping. So I become easier to hit. I become easier to hit and that's it. Um that's it. But my uh my damage resistance goes up. So I will take it. Um, I mean, it goes up marginally. Uh, my my main goes up marginally, but the the rest of it goes up. Um, how much ex uh, explode goes up by ten? Gas goes up by uh, you know a bunch. I mean, it goes up from what zero to seventy. So wow, wow. Very cool. Very, very cool. Okay. A little bit more of the explode uh, resistance is going to be good, too. I mean, I can always use a little bit more resistance to that. Because that has been... You know, really, especially in the last few levels, that's been what's... That's been what's ending it. You know, um, the last couple of levels have been the only time tanks died, and it's been because of um, explosives. Explosives that are just a little bit beyond my capacity. Okay, let's bring him in there, because that looks like one of those guys that just is ridiculously tough. Unnecessarily tough. Stein leveled up. You can give him a... Oh. Well. Oh, shoot. Okay, well. I'm gonna... I'll pick Stein's perk later, too. I don't wanna... Don't wanna... Oh, man. We're getting a lot of... A uh, lot of 50 cal action here. Now, I really hope... Uh, I really hope that we get some power armor soon. And not just... Uh, not just power armor... Uh, just for tank. Because, um... I know it increases your strength, and Stein needs some strength so he can, um, so he can wield, uh, so he can wield 50 cal. That is a very, very serious um, machine gun. In fact, um, if I remember correctly, the uh, heavy weapons guy that I made in this game—I mean, that was that—I mean, he was using that to the end. That was what he was rocking all the way up through the end of the game. You know, no question about it. You know, he got the job done. Got the job done. Um, wait, hang on a second. Um, you know, I'm really thinking that uh, we are... 
Well, I don't know why I wouldn't be able to... So it said that there's a subterranean entrance, and I mean, there's one here. But I don't know why I would really necessarily need to use it. Um... Only known method of entering the factory. Which... I mean, that was over here. Well... I, I don't know, I think... I'm assuming I just have to attack this place, but I'm, anyway, I want to pop my voodoo now. Because that's what we do here. And then I'm going to go in here and see what I can do in terms of killing this guy here, because I know this guy's got some grenades. Let's bring Stein in. Bring in Stein. Farsight. Where's Boomer? Might as well be bring in Boomer and 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 whatnot. Oh, jeez! <laughs> Just line them up. It is not advisable to walk through that uh, passageway right there. Ooh, some more buff out. I will take it, and gladly so. Gladly will I take it. Gladly will I... Ho? Uh, I'm sorry, I couldn't come up with anything that rhymed. My bad. Charge! Kill that guy! Get in there! Oh jeez, he ruined that guy. Lit him up. Lit him up. Okay. Got another guy here. Bring in Stein. Be careful with him. I want to get him. Oh, I got blinded. We're gonna have to bring in Stitch to uh, rectify that situation. Okay, Stitch, get in here. Get the heck in here. I'm gonna check these guys since that one guy had buff out on him. Some of these other ones might too. I think there were. I thought there were two guys there. Okay, Dr. Bag. Tank. Head. Actually. Have Boomer check this door here for uh, potential traps. Seems like the kind of thing they trap at this point. Okay, it's not trapped. Let's get Tank in there. Um. 
Boomer, let's take this one out in style. Kablammo! Power generator three destroyed. That's what I'm talking about. Uh-oh. Run. I don't want don't want my people to get killed while I be screwing around here. You are such a fool. You think you're doing the wasteland a favor she is by hideous. fighting us? We are the wasteland's last chance. The menace from the west doesn't know pity or remorse or fear, and it will not stop until everything is dead. Only super mutants can stop this threat. And we need this lab to solve our sterility problem, to build up our numbers. You fight on the side oh my of goodness. ignorance. I fight for salvation. Um. Well. Eat that. Whoa, whoops. Oh, come on. I need to... Commander... Uh, I want Commander... There we go. Oh, I had the old cattle prod and a cookie. That is the appropriate loadout for the base commander, I think. Oh, some more environmental armor. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I am freaking talking about, people. We're getting some pretty serious stuff here. Who picked that up? Give that to Stein. Because Stein's my boy. And then that can... Got a, we got a trickle-down situation going on here. And uh, Boomer can wear that. And, um... Let's see. Tank had... Tank had some metal armor mark two that he can give to Stitch. He can wear oh. Okay. Farsight can wear that. So everyone's got some better armor now. Oh whoops. Yeah. I'm gonna send Farsight in. She's gonna take care of the rest of this. She's got it. She's got it. No problem. No problem. Let's get everyone out of the way there so they don't get completely blown away when I open the door here. Mutant scientist. Something doesn't seem right there. Now, Ed, Ed's my science guy, right? Whoops. Um... He's got 115 science. Um, so yeah, he is my science guy. But uh, what's going on here? What in the devil is going on here? Oh, I guess I'm going to have Ed talk to, to Mutant Freak. Our only hope is here. Oh shoot. What the heck am I supposed to do here? Huh? Who are you, and why are you here? Oh dear, your brotherhood. Oh please, don't destroy my research. Do you realize what kind of resources oh and luck it took to make a functioning lab like this? We're so close to a cure, so close. What would the brotherhood gain by destroying this research? Please, just leave me and my equipment alone. We can't stop now, do you understand? This is my people's last chance. Um skill science. Um science. Let's see if I can blind this dude with science. Um, well, my mission objectives are to blow this dude's generator up. And, uh, that didn't change, per se. By per se, I mean it, it, it just flat out, it didn't change, so. Um, 
it's not like I really have a choice, you know. Um, I'm pretty sure it's got to happen. Don't touch my equipment, please. I mean, <clears throat> you know, uh, I, I, there's part of me that would like to be able to extend the olive branch here. You know, I mean, the guy's certainly being peaceful. Uh, that guy is. None of the other super mutants were. But, um, uh, you know, what option do I have? What, what choice do I really have? Of course, now my, my concern at this point is, you know, when this guy goes completely bonkers, like, does everyone blow up and, let me, I'm gonna get my party out of what I believe to be harm's way here. And I'm gonna go run in here and punch this generator. <laughs> because that's the smart thing to do. I, I guess. Power generator four destroyed. All power generators have been destroyed. Mission objectives complete. Proceed to the exit grid to leave this mission. Um. That another rocket launcher there. So I mean, there's a there's an exit grid here. I mean, uh, truly, I I don't know, don't know. Uh, I mean, he doesn't seem too upset about the fact that I um, you know, uh, broke his generator. I don't know if. They're going to be mad about the fact that, um, um, if the Brotherhood's going to be mad that I don't trash all this stuff. And these, these things are, they don't look like they want to, it's fairly obvious they want to die. Um... I don't know. I think if memory serves, the last time I played this game, I think I just went kind of gangbusters in here and just blew this dude away and just shot all these things up. But I honestly can't remember. Um, but I'm going to go against my gut feeling. I'm going to go against my gut feeling and let the guy live. And, uh, you know, let these abominations live as well. Because it looks like I can. And uh, I'm just going to go to the exit grid and uh, and see what happens. Now I hope, I sincerely hope. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go. I'm going to go back so I can get my vehicle because I don't want to. Um, I don't want to leave without it because I've got a bunch of loot that I put into it. And in addition, I hope it lets me. Um, I hope that it lets me keep my um, APC because I got a bunch of stuff in that too you know I drove my APC to this mission so got a bunch of what ifs bunch of unanswered questions so suppose we are about to find out And there is certainly part of me that wants to go and fight those uh, super mutants that I saw uh, kind of perceived through the wall, I guess, up there. But the other part of me just kind of thinks that for some reason it would cause me to die. And uh, at this point, I am not willing to entertain. Whoops. Not willing to entertain the possibility. I just want to just want to get out of here because I died on this mission once and uh, I want to uh, 
want to make it out. Whoops. Want to make it out. Good work, brother. It seems the scribes were mistaken. The mutants were conducting research on irradiated DNA and not manufacturing weapons at this location. But you did the right thing by completing your objectives and destroying their power generator. Okay. There is an old brotherhood saying, better to err on the side of caution. This is war, and they are the enemy. Further reports indicate that our maneuver was successful. The mutants are pulling out of the area in droves, with the main force divided into four separate groups, each heading in a different direction. Two of the smaller groups seem to have an erratic course, quite possibly a decoy tactic. Of the remaining large groups, one is traveling deep into the wasteland, while the other seems to be heading mm -hmm. towards a small town. We will have to investigate both. I also want to inform you that Repo Squad has recovered the mutant scientific equipment back to our base, where research will be allowed to continue on mutant sterility. If we can find the cure, it may prove to be quite the bargaining chip. Well done, warrior. Well done. Oh. Dismiss. Okay, so keeping the... Uh Keeping the, um, the equipment intact was the right thing to do. So oddly enough, that was against my gut feeling. Shows you, shows you what my gut, um, what my gut's um, inclinations are in terms of right and wrong. At least relative to this game's right and wrong. Mutants, giant rats, dogs, and beast lords. That sounds like a recipe for fun. Nope. I want to get back to base. This whole saga is roughly two hours and 20 minutes of gameplay footage that I have to edit down now. And, uh, get into two, hopefully two half-hour videos. Of course, um, I'm not sure if that's going to be entirely, entirely possible. We shall see. Success! Whoa! Okay, yeah, did let me have all my vehicles back here. Uh, Veritable, oh my goodness, okay. It's kind of weird, you gotta like, get into vehicles, and then get out of vehicles, to like, make the engines shut off. It's a weird, weird little glitch there. But to, as usual, I'm gonna, you know, go around, check out the equipment, buy and sell stuff, and see if I can find, uh, you know, better people to swap, uh, you know, get a more ideal squad loadout. But, uh, as always, Thanks for watching, and we'll pick up here next time.